Hi everyone, welcome to Vlogmas day four. So for today, I thought I would show you some of the stocking stuffers that I've picked up. I've got an absolute ton of products here. I don't know that I'll talk about all of them, but I thought I would talk about what I had picked up for baby Ren. If you are a regular viewer, you will know that I have a brand new grandbaby. She's six weeks old, my first grandbaby. And so I've got her stocking stuffers here. I've got stuff for her mom, Randy, and then I've got stuff for my husband and stuff for my boy. So kind of a wide array of stocking stuffers. I love stockings. Stockings are probably my favorite part about Christmas, honestly or one of, I mean, I just love Christmas. Now, having said all that, I have tried to cut back a little bit this year. However, these are my stockings. <laughs> so I can't just put three things in there because they are massive. So I will say for Ren, the little baby, all I did was a stocking for her this year. She's six weeks old. She doesn't need a thing. And both her mom and dad kind of said, you know, we are out of space in our house. We've already received so many gifts, you know, with baby showers and all of that, right? They've got so much stuff and they just don't have room in their house for any more kind of big items or big toys. I thought we could film here in front of the Christmas tree, kind of festive. I'm down on the ground, so I'm on the hardwood, you guys. We need to get through this kind of quick. Okay, before we get started with the stocking stuffers, let's open day four of our advent. I have been doing this every day of Vlogmas. Number four. Oh, look at number four. That is kind of a weird shape. I wonder what that could be. Ooh. I'm very excited. It's the Power Grip Primer. I do have a full size of this. I absolutely love this product. I use it all the time. It helps smooth out some of my crepiness is why I love this and why I use it. And the full size I have is almost done. So I'm very happy to have that. Okay, let's get into what I got for Ren. So I wasn't going to get her any clothes because she has so many clothes. So she, they received so much clothing for the baby shower and just from friends and family just so many clothes. I've joked that they probably don't have to do laundry for a whole year, like so many clothes. But I was over there visiting yesterday and Randy said, you know what actually we don't have is a Christmas outfit, like a cute little outfit to wear for Christmas. I was like, oh, okay, <laughs> I'm on it. And so I went last night over to Carter's and Oshkosh and I got this little dress <laughs> and it's got the little did we call these bloomers? I don't even know. It's been so long since I've dressed a baby, but it's really cute. It's got layers. It's a little bit puffy on the bottom. It's got this Christmas flower print on it and then little buttons down the back. And then I thought, you know, because it's sleeveless, I got a little red cardigan to go with it and some little tights that have the puff on the bum. So that's our little Christmas outfit. And then because I love going to the pool and I'm hoping to take her to the pool with me, I got her a little swimsuit. How cute is that? Um, I don't know if we will get to the pool when she's little enough to wear that, but it was so cute. And then I got her this towel for when we go to the pool. You know, it's one of those animal ones. It's got the big elephant that you know you wear as a cap and then wrap up in the towel after and then I got her a little water mat so you fill it up with water and inside it's for tummy time but there's little sea creatures that float around in there I thought that was super cute I got her the night before Christmas in a board book so that we can read that together a little teething ring that I thought was kind of cute some bath toys. My boys had actually these same bath toys when they were little, so I thought those were super cute. And then I got her at Zara. Well, I actually got these at Winners, but they're from Zara. And they're these little suede booties. So cute. I wish they were maybe black because I feel like they would have gone with the Christmas outfit. I couldn't find shoes to go with that Christmas outfit. Newborn shoes are so hard. And then the last thing for her is from Ever Eden. And I had shown these before, but I got some bath stuff off of Sephora. This is a uh, body, no, baby shampoo and wash. And this is a massage oil. So that's what I got for little baby Ren. So I didn't get her too much because they had kind of asked me not to, right? So 
It's very hard not to buy a million baby outfits when you're the mom of two boys and then your son has a little girl. <laughs> it's very hard. <laughs> So that is for little Ren. I am probably not gonna have time, honestly, to link everything or anything even. We kind of have a full day today and I wanted to get a Vlogmas video up and I wanted to get this one up because I feel like stocking stuff or ideas can be tricky. But for me to link all this stuff would, honestly, it would take me hours and hours. So I'm gonna just say that this is mostly for ideas sake and not necessarily you know, stuff you can just link and, and buy. So I apologize for that, but I just know I'm not gonna have time. Okay, let's do Randy's stocking. So that's my son's girlfriend. I got her a wet brush. I got her this set from Philosophy. I found this at Winners and it's the Amazing Grace Ballet Rose. I thought that was a really nice little set. I, I hope she likes that scent. I do, I quite like that scent. I got her this set. It's a skincare set from Chorus. I got this off of the BoxyCharm pop-up sale. And I thought it was quite nice because it's got some vitamin C stuff in it. It's got a serum, an oil, and a moisturizer. I got her an all-over body scrub, a Epsom salt uh, soap. I'm gonna put these in there. One is a hand mask. Oh, they're both hand masks from Sephora. A hair clip. I have one of these as well. It's kind of this pretty blush pink color. She's got quite a bit of hair, so she will like that. A Invisibobble scrunchie. A little candle. That one is Cozy Cabin Scent. I got her a couple of these spongels. A little mini hand cream. And then I actually picked some of these up from the Asian market. I got my sons each a flavor too, but this one is a water jelly in peach. I just thought these looked so interesting. So I grabbed three of them and one was for her. And then I got her this. It's one of those hot mama pickles and I got my son the hot papa pickle. And then I got these to go with it because I see people online eat these pickles with these as well. And this is Swinkles, I think it's called. So yeah, I've seen people put this with the pickle. I don't know, but it looks so interesting. And so that's what I got for her, for her stocking. Oh, and then I do usually put some kind of little alcohol item in. And at a local little farmer's market for my sons and Randy, I got these locally made little moonshines and they look like they're in little mini moonshine bottles they're so cute it's west west off of fifth this is spiced cranberry apple pie and i think this is peppermint yeah peppermint shine so i thought those were cute i do usually put some kind of little alcohol in their stockings okay and then probably the cutest thing i bought my husband's upstairs so i don't want to say it too loud but for, for me and my husband, I'm Nana, and my husband is Papa, and his name is Barry, so we call him Papa Bear. And I got him this Papa Bear pajama set, and it's one of those one-piece ones. I wish, I don't know, maybe I could take it out, but then I don't think I'll get it back in here. But it's got little bears on it, and then it's got that little flap on the bum, and then I got a matching one for him and Ren. Let me take her so to show you. So his looks just like this, like hers. <laughs> it says bear bum. <laughs> How cute are those? So oh, I'm so excited. So I got him that in his stocking, a little matching pajama set for him and his granddaughter. I got those from Little Blue House and they feel like very good quality. I think it's a company out of the US. They were a little bit expensive. To be honest, I think you can find matching pajama sets like Old Navy and stuff is much cheaper, but I will say these do feel like really good quality. Um, the company was great to deal with. I ordered, they arrived fairly quickly. So yeah, I'm really happy with those, but again, they were a little bit pricey. And then I got him some peppermint bark coffee because he does like a festive coffee. And then I got him some of this Everyman Jack body wash with a deodorant to go with it this this scent i had never smelled before it's sea salt and oops it's really nice it's really fresh i just got this from the drugstore 
like just my local drugstore and it was not at all expensive. Like I think this giant thing of body wash was less than $10 and it's almost 17 ounces, so, and it smells really, really good. And then I got him this toffee latte bubble bath milk that kind of comes in a milk jug. I'm not, I'm not completely done with his stocking yet. I still do need to grab a few things. And then the last thing I have for him is this Terry's chocolate orange, because we were talking the other day, and I had said I had actually never tried one of these, and he said he used to get one in his stocking all the time. So I thought, well, perfect, I'll grab that for him. That's everything that's in his stocking. Let me grab the big box that I got for the boys. <laughs> it's a big box. Okay. So I got all their stuff in one box here and not really separated, but I'll try to touch on who is for who. So both my boys work up north in some pretty cold, a pretty cold environment. So I got them each a set of merino wool socks. And then I also, from Costco, got them each a pack of like regular everyday socks. I do socks every year in their stockings. And you know, that way it's just, they always have each year a fresh set of socks. And then I got them quite a few snacks at the Asian market. So I know I have mentioned before that all of us really love to try new things. Like our favorite thing is to get, um, food boxes from around the world, which I, I'll show you when I go through what I picked up for everyone for their Christmas gifts. I do, I did Snack Crate this year. I've done different different subscription boxes over the years, but this year I did Snack Crate and every month you get a box of snacks from a different country. And so I did get everybody one of those, but I also wanted to add in some snacks in my boys' stockings. And so I went to the Asian market and I picked up some chips. These are both hot pot flavor chips. Now, of course, I don't really know what because I can't read the Chinese writing, but I would say this is like a hot pepper hot pot. And this one looks like another flavor of hot pot. They're lace chips. I bet you they're going to be delicious. And then, yeah, like I said, I picked them each up one of these water jellies one in mango and one in pineapple. Those look delicious. From Costco, I got my younger son some sriracha almonds because he is obsessed with sriracha. That's a nice big bag of that. Oh, there's that big pop of pickle for my younger son. And I got him the little candy to go with it. I found these on well.ca. I was ordering sunscreen. These are squish, bonbonsquish.com, and these are hot skulls. So they're sweet gummy candies on the outside, and then inside is a hot jelly candy, some kind of hotness on the inside. So they're sweet and hot, and I thought my kids would really, really like those. So I got them each one of those. I got some little Smarty Chocolates to put in for everybody. Got some little mini Toblerones for everybody. I did get both of them each one of these candles as well. This is apple spice and gingerbread cookie. This was a little three pack I got off Sephora. You know what? They're not great. I, I probably wouldn't. I'm, I, I a little bit regret getting them. They're not great. And then for my older son, he's kind of getting into some skincare stuff. And so I had already given him... Um, a sunscreen and a retinol. And then I thought I would get him this ordinary niacinamide that he could add in. And I also got him a face scrub. I thought he might like that. So I'm not familiar with this brand at all, but I got it at Winners. And then I also got him this chicken and waffles chocolate. <laughs> Delicious. And I got him one of these Marvin's toothpastes. And this is in it's exotic spicy flavors, and I think this flavor is cara caracum? I'm not sure, actually. And it's sealed, so I can't even tell you what it is, and there's not much information on it, but I just thought it looked really interesting and that he might like that. He's kind of adventurous. Oh, actually, it's not even, it's not even sealed. It just smells like a minty toothpaste, but maybe once you actually try it, it's some kind of exotic spicy flavor. And then the last thing in their stockings, I got them each an instant hot pot. So I got this one. Yeah, there isn't any English on it, so I I'm not sure what this is, but if you've never tried one of these inside here, you add a little bit of water to this little heating pad that's in there, and then it cooks itself in here. So I got that one for one of them, and I got this one 
for the other one. These are really, really neat. I've done a few of them over the years and it's like a little self-contained oven and it cooks the soup or stew or whatever right in there. So I know they'll, they'll find those neat and probably do them right on Christmas day just to try it. So <laughs> there you go. There's some Christmas gift ideas for what I did for stocking stuffers this year. I will film a video on what I did for Christmas gifts. I did cut back this year. This is less than I have done in other years, but again, just overall trying to cut back. Yeah. So I hope there was some ideas in here. If you were looking for stocking stuffer ideas, I did do some lots of food stuff for my kids this year because again, they love that. If, I wish I had time to link everything, but I just don't. This would this would take me six hours to link all this stuff. So we are off now. Um, we need to go get our Christmas ham. We are actually doing our Christmas celebration next weekend. So we need to go get our Christmas ham and we wanted to stop and have some dim sums. So yeah, I hope you're enjoying Vlogmas. This is uh, day number four. I'm, I'm, I'm hanging in there. I'm doing pretty good. So yeah. I, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, if you would subscribe, that would be amazing. I will see you guys in my, I actually, I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye everyone.